room here. And it will go into the middle now. It's goal! With a brilliant hit! Hey guys welcome back to another video from Andrew Based. In today's video I am going to show you how you can run FIFA 12 on your Mali device uh, using WinLater emulator. So for this game you can use WinLater Mali latest version or even you can use the official WinLater version. And if you are using WinLater latest version make sure you download the latest uh, build of this WinLater Mali because a specific setting is needed to run this game without black screen issue. So let me quickly show you the setting. So for that you can just just create the container and just uh, follow my settings so here just change the screen size to 800 800 by 600 after that just uh, here the main setting that you have to follow is you have to change the DX wrapper to CNC D draw instead of wind D3D okay and rest of the things will <coughs> remain as it is uh, even if you want you can change this video memory size to 4096 because this game actually it's a little bit uh, more ram as compared to other games and as usual you can change the box 86 and 64 preset to performance to get slightly better stability in game that's it guys you can just create this container and just run it okay after the containers open up no need to do any kind of extra settings just simply go inside your game folder and run the game that's EA Sports. It's in the game. Welcome to the, for this drill, move your player close to the ball and when you're in a good position, press to stand. We should have a fine game for you today. I'm Martin Tyler, Alan Smith is with me. Welcome to you all. Well, this is a match that has a rivalry that's, I think, fairly bitter. You would be very close to it as a former Arsenal player, Alan, but it goes back to the days when Arsenal actually moved from south of the River Thames into Tottenham territory, and that's been handed down by the Tottenham fans from generation to generation. They do not like Arsenal. No, they don't. You could say that. Always special, even in the week leading up to it. You reminded it as an Arsenal or Spurs player. And the referee blows. The flag was up for offside. to the box now trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross here comes the cross and the referee does blow the flag was up from the assistant Scott Parker and the pass cut out at a truly vital time well the ball can go in Shots off, and they've scored. That's the first goal of the game. He took the low road here, the low route, and it was the right route to get this goal. It's a striker on top of his game. His awareness in the box, he knew exactly what was around him, and his touch was secure, and his shot was just top class. Goes out into the wide position. Now they're passing the ball well. This is the chance. And they're a goal down, but now they've got a corner. Could make a chance to equalise.
Good challenge, good contest. Great opportunity. He's gone for goal, and it's in. An Arsenal goal. They're turning on the style now with two goals in very quick succession. Well, how much skill did he show there? He didn't even look up. He didn't need any help. He knew exactly what he wanted to do, and it was a wonderful effort. In goes Alex Song, and Arsenal have possession. They've won it. Good ball. What a chance! That's a real tussle for the ball. That was a pass that deserved a goal. Oh, you're right, Martin. It should have ended up better than that. Metasak. The assistant has raised the flag for offside. Javinho, this is what defenders hate, facing a fellow like this. Great ball. And the shot's off. And the goalkeeper wins that battle of wits. And it was a battle of wits, wasn't it? I think he made it a bit too obvious, though, the striker, where he was going to put it. Modric. Arsenal have the ball again. Bale. Ooh, nice back heel there. Asue Kotto. And that deflection sends the ball into touch. And this is going to be a throw. So. And then you've sort of overseen the move from Highbury to the Emirates. And Arsenal somehow, have, in a time where stadiums like Wembley are built at huge, huge expense. This has been very safe goalkeeping to make the stop and keep hold of the ball. Rather been given away. Something could be on here. Flag went up straight away, referee blew offside. Daniel Adebayor, nicely done between the two of them. The Marlins challenge, and Arsenal have possession. They've won it. That's a good pass. Great opportunity. Got room here. And it will go into the middle now. It's good! Well, the captain has done a great job here. Real contribution from him. Yeah, when they needed somebody to pop up, it was the man with the arm.